Today's project is throwing a cup with a twist. This is a very thin cup, so I use a small throwing butt to avoid the distortion. I use 350 gram white stoneware clay. This clay is smooth and fine compared with the sanded buff clay I normally use. I choose this clay when I want to draw something on the surface. I make a hole in the center with my right thumb and my left thumb gives support on top. I leave the bottom about 7 mm thick. I use a wooden spatula to compress the bottom. I ensure even surface at the bottom as this will prevent a S crack. I am also measuring the internal size with this spatula. I leave 1.5 cm between the spatula and the wall, so the internal cup size becomes 5 cm. I stretch the wall gently for the first time. I want to make a smooth thin wall in this project. So it is good practice to start from even surface. The right hand ring finger gives good pressure at the bottom of the wall. I don't want to leave too much clay at the bottom. I keep this hand shape, then slowly bring them straight up. The left middle finger is on the opposite side of the wall, but slightly higher than the right middle finger. My left index finger is compressing the top of the wall when I reach the top. And both my middle fingers are still there, so the clay is compressed from three directions, which makes it stronger. I don't want to trim this cup too much, as I will make a twist later. So I use a spatula to pull the wall much thinner and even in the final stretch. I use a plastic kidney to clean the internal wall. Which material you use is up to your preference. This can be also wood or metal. The point is to understand the feature of the material and the outcome. I am finalizing the shape. I have a large mirror in front of the wheel so I can check the shape without changing my position. I can check the cup shape with just a quick glance in the mirror. 
This means I can save time and also prevent back pain. This is a final stage of throwing. I am trimming the bottom corner. This gap will be a good guide when I cut it. With a string later. I push a piece of clay onto the wheel to attach the cup. I don't need to trim this cup a lot. I just want to scrape a few marks on the surface to make it smooth for the drawing. When I use metal tools on the electric wheel, it makes me nervous. I handle them very carefully. I am trimming the bottom. I make the center hole for the finger rest. Then I am taking the corner off. It will reduce the chance of chipping. I am checking the clay's resistance. I trim it until it gives soft resistance. I think this is a trial and error situation. You will know when you should stop after you make a few mistakes. I draw my cat with black slip on the green wear cap. 